Good evening and welcome to the Daily Market Update. The DSEX extended its gaining streak today as the market further gained 68.66 points or 1.33 percent and settled at 5,242 points. Market turnover was 3.58 billion Bangladeshi takas, which is an increase of 3.9 percent compared to the previous trading day. Islami Bank Bangladesh, Brac Bank and Rupali Bank from the banking sector, Renata, Square Pharma and Beacon Pharma from the pharmaceutical sector, and BSRM Steel, Walton and GPH Icebat from the industrial sector mainly pulled the market up today. In terms of sector-wise return, the insurance sector posted the highest gain of 3.85% and the mutual fund sector registered the second highest gain of 2.31%. On the other hand, the cement sector posted the highest loss of 0.73%. Levin Insurance and three pharmaceuticals companies were among the top 20 gainers today. Paramount Insurance Company Limited, Dhaka Insurance Limited and Bengal Windsor Thermoplastics PLC registered the highest gain while Pragati Life Insurance Limited, NRB Bank PLC LC and SK Trims and Industries Limited were the top losers today. Pragati Life Insurance Limited and NRB Bank PLC have experienced a notable decline in their share prices following the announcement of an upcoming board of directors meeting. SK Trims and Industries Limited has seen a significant drop in its share prices following the High Court's decision to extend the stay order on the company's frozen bank account. There is no publicly disclosed price sensitive information for the price change of the remaining stocks. The trading volume of Apex Spinning and Knitting Mills, Federal Insurance and United Finance increased significantly today compared compared to the average trading volume of the last three months. The trade volume of United Finance increased significantly today as the company scheduled its third quarter earnings release date on 24th of October. There was no publicly disclosed fundamental reason for the volume increase for the rest of the stocks. Top two news today. Fitch Ratings has revised Bangladesh's FY25 growth forecast down to 4.5% from 5.3%, citing increased policy uncertainty following a political transition. Similarly, the World Bank lowered its projection to 4%, attributing the change to political turmoil and data unavailability. Despite external financing pressures and a recent downgrade to B+, Fitch anticipates a recovery in growth to 5.7% in FY26, contingent on structural reforms, notably remittances rose to $2.4 billion in September, and exports increased by 6.78% year-on-year in September. However, ongoing political risks and potential challenges to IMF loan targets may threaten this optimistic outlook. The Bangladesh Bank has raised its policy rate by 50 basis points to 10%, effective from October 27. This follows a previous increase to 9.5% on September 24. Since May 2022, the policy rate has been raised 10 times, rising from just 5%. This latest hike marks the fifth increase in 2024 alone, reflecting the central bank's ongoing efforts to manage inflation and stabilize the economy amid changing economic conditions. That's all for today. Thank you.